Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to talk about masks. And of course you know what living in Anda is all about. So all of these masks are made with clean and non-toxic ingredients, are cruelty free and they come in all price ranges. I'll tell you all about why I love each of them, the key ingredients and how I use them. Putting on a face mask is one of my favorite self-care rituals. It forces you to slow down and there is just something so soothing about slathering them onto your skin. And of course, all the products are linked in the description below and I have included the prices as well. And before we begin, please subscribe to my channel and like this video, it would mean the world to me. The first mask is Flora by Esteli. It is made with French pink clay, rose hips, hibiscus, and lavender. It is full of antioxidants, helps even skin tone, diminish wrinkles, and clean pores. The mask comes in powder form, which means you just need to add water, but I also like to mix it with toner or even with a few drops of my favorite facial oil. I love to use this mask before putting makeup on. My foundation just looks flawless and my skin super smooth. But of course, if I put it on at the end of the day, I wake up with perfect skin. It also helps tone down the greasiness and the size of my pores. Another reason why I like this mask is because you don't need too much time to do it. But when I want to take my time, as it starts drying, I spray some more toner to give it more life. The next mask is Clearly Mask by Isabella's Clearly. It is made with activated charcoal, hyaluronic acid, jojoba, and aloe leaf juice. It helps clarify, hydrate, and moisturize the skin. It is also non-irritating. The consistency is very lightweight, almost like a runny gel, and it is a non-drying formula. I like that this mask is ready to go and that there is no prep time. Just grab your mask brush and dip it on the jar and you're good to go. It is equal parts refreshing and soothing and since it is not drying, it means that I can relax a little bit while I have it on without worrying. After rinsing my skin, feels super supple. The next mask or masks I should say is the Enzymos Ferrets Peeling Cream and the Micropores Bioactive Mask by Pivonium. I always use these two together even though they could work separately. The peeling cream uses oat amino acids and the mask uses red clover extract and hyaluronic acid. And they both work to eliminate blackheads, dead skin cells and toxins. And as you can see they both have a creamy consistency making them very easy to apply. I first apply the peeling cream and spread it with my wet fingertips and leave it on for 2 minutes then rinse with my Pivonia cleanser. Next up I apply the mask and leave it on for 15 minutes. This one is also non-drying so I usually sit back and relax while I have it on. After rinsing my skin feels clean and not dry at all. The next one is a Hyaluronic Acid and Oats Overnight Recovery Mask by Herbal Dynamics Beauty. This one is made with oat extract, hyaluronic acid, tremella mushroom, aloe vera, and broccoli extracts. This one detoxifies, brightens, hydrates, and plumps the skin and softens fine lines. The texture is like a thick moisturizer and you just apply it on clean skin before bed. You don't need a lot, but yet it spreads easily and you just need a light layer all over. It doesn't leave a greasy feel, so you don't need to worry about leaving it all on your pillow. The next morning, I just wash it off when I shower and my skin feels incredibly smooth and soft. And the last one is Clearly Clay by Isabella's Clearly. It is made with 100% pure French green clay and nothing else. The clay acts as a magnet to draw toxins and also drink pores and remove excess oils. This mask also comes in powder form and you can mix it with water, essential or carrier oils to target different skin concerns. It is especially great for rosacea, eczema and psoriasis. 
When mixed with water, it forms a creamy paste and the texture is super smooth. It feels incredibly luxurious when putting it on. I like to apply it with a brush for a more even and smoother application. And even though this mask does dry, it takes a longer time than others to do so. When I rinse it, my skin feels like I just did a deep cleanse but doesn't feel dry or flaky. You can also use it as a hair mask or a body detox bath. And that's it you guys, let me know if you like this video format and if you would like to see more product comparisons. And if so, let me know which type of products you want to see next. I'll see you next week, bye!